but move forwards, I suppose. I've already been up. I got a, a morning coffee and I got done with some breakfast. I got her a croissant, one with chocolate and then just a normal croissant. So she's got breakfast in bed. Mm. Um, but yeah, we're both gonna go, we're going on like a boat trip today off the coast of uh, Phuket. And we get to kayak through like sort of mini islands and caves and stuff. So hopefully we get some wicked footage. Uh, Very exciting. Yeah, cannot wait. So, awesome. Just being picked up on our way to the boat. So we've uh, arrived, we're just waiting for a few other people. Um, I think they said two other people. So, it might be quite a small trip, which would be nice. But to be going out, out there. Again, it's not 100% blue skies, which is a shame, but it's better than raining. Uh, and obviously it's warm, it's super warm. So, yeah, can't wait. Are you excited? I am excited. So we're on our way, we're on the boat. We got um, we got told as soon as we were away from the CCTV we could take these off. Yeah. <laughs> guy comes up, sure. yeah, guy comes up to us, points out the CCTV cameras, like don't worry, as soon as we're away from here, you can take off the live jackets. Which is, which is great. Like, you have to look at the buffet, look at the set it up. There's a, they've just set up a buffet over there. Maybe I'll get one on my other camera. But for now I'm just gonna do a time lapse. Look to the front. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, thank you. Yes, can we? Yeah. Yes. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, boy. Uh, man, it's fucking warm. You right, bro? <laughs> How deep is the water? Deep, like four meters. Yeah, three meters. Three Yeah, boy. Man, it's nice. Very, very nice. My life vest on. Mm. Not a good swimmer. <laughs> My curls make a sure I'm too. Fuck. I just got stung by a jellyfish. I don't know if you can see it. Little fucker. Ah, jellyfish. They're not allowed to go over there. The guys are like, don't hide from us. And they're hiding from them. They literally, they are like, I don't know if you can see them on the camera, but they're like all the way over there. And the guides are like, Look, everyone's, like what the everyone's going <laughs> over there as well. I just feel like if there's something happened. Uh, these are the naughty ones that went exactly where they were told not to. Loads of them. Absolutely loads of them. So we're really deciding to leave them. Bye. We found them. We we got them, and now they're getting told off. Uh oh. 
So I didn't record that, but the first people that tried to go into the cave caught their boat on the rocks, which are really um, sharp, and they popped their they popped the hole. So they've just had to like swim out holding their boat because they basically sunk. So we're about to go through in a minute. So that's them letting air out of the boats so that we can fit through because the tide's high. That's where we just came from. You can see another boat coming. This is an enclosed sort of lagoon. Tide's gone down. Much easier. <laughs> first lagoon arch just suddenly got really windy um i didn't video breakfast but there was like a whole breakfast spread of like egg noodles and rice and fruit and loads of stuff i don't even know what it was i should have taken a photo really or some video but i just forgot i was too busy stuffing my face <laughs> um now i have like a light lunch um, and i think there's a buffet later as well but basically just sandwiches cake and the most important thing is coffee Freshly brewed coffee. But yeah, 
as you can see from the videos and photos, that was amazing. Just as good as we thought it was going to be. Demo was like freaking out when we were going through the cave originally, but then once you got through, she was used to it, it was sound. So at this point we made our own kratons, which is like an ancient Thai tradition. I believe it originates in India. Uh, it's to show respect to, to Buddha um, and also the water god, uh, goddess, sorry. Um, you're basically thanking the water uh, for, you know, helping supply water for the rice fields um, and the fishing and the tide and so on. Uh, but also apologising for any misuse of the water. Uh, it's made of completely biodegradable stuff, and once a year, I think usually in November, there's like a festival where you the Thai people will make their own and float them down the river. Um, it's made of a banana tree trunk with banana leaves, and then a few different plants, um, and the different plants mean different things, like one of them means longevity of life, and one means prosperity, um, and then they also have incense sticks and so on that go on there. Um, because of the trip that we're doing, um, they didn't usually they would use instead of using metal nails which don't biodegrade, they'd use bits of the um, uh, banana tree instead. But because for speed of the trip, we used nails, but it did mean that we weren't able to float them off and leave them to float off. We had to collect them all um, and then take them back onto the boat and have them um, sort of be disposed of correctly. Otherwise, the company would get in trouble for littering, which is fair enough. But yeah, pretty cool experience in general, um, and really pretty to see. So on that beach, the rangers for the National Park live, like four, three or four, and there's 160 sort of, uh, I don't know what you call them, rock formations that they look after in this National Park. <laughs> fast. Very fast. <laughs> Very fast. Yeah. We are cleaning the ocean. Give it. A shoe, you want a free shoe? <laughs> <laughs> An amazing day. I got her again. I always get her. It's because he got his camera out like this for ages. Photo? And then he'll record. It's bullshit. This is not to be believed. <laughs> <laughs> Dinner time, motherfucker.
So we just got back, went to 7-Eleven for some snacks. That was amazing, wasn't it? Amazing. Like... Tired now, though. Very tired. You'll see all the clips before this, so you'll see, hopefully... It was insane. Like, this, that was, like, by far, like, the best thing we've done. I don't think we're going to be able to very easily beat that. No. Um, yeah. Outstanding. The food was great. The weather was, was good enough. Um, weather was fine. The weather was was great as well, to be fair, and um, the water was nice. It was completely still, wasn't raining, wasn't choppy. Yeah, amazing. Hopefully, as I said, you can see from the videos, but hopefully you don't get bored because it's this this vlog is just gonna be those videos and photos. Mm. But yeah, I'm not sure. I'm hopefully, put my down there. <laughs> hopefully it comes into that's a different type of thing. Can't put it on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> um, Hopefully it comes across on camera how, how just how good it was. It was like spectacular, amazing. And we met this lovely Irish couple. Yeah. Um, we had a great chat with as well, so. We were nice. Anyway, we're just gonna eat our snacks and shower and go to sleep. Bye.